In light of Midnight Sun's release being announced, I've decided to settle the Team Edward vs. Jacob debate once and for all by creating Jedward. This was kind of hard because Robert Pattinson and Taylor Lautner are like three shades apart, and Taylor is very warm-toned while Robert is very much blue. The picture of Taylor was also way lower quality, but I managed to work around that. Robert has some very luscious locks. I wonder what conditioner he uses. I haven't fact-checked this, but from the looks of it Robert has also broken his nose at some point of time, and I was almost not going to edit it in, but then it just looked like Taylor with blue eyes and better hair so I had to make do. He looked kind of too young so I decided to add Robert's jaw. He turned out surprisingly attractive, and I mean that honestly. I give him a 10 out of 10 and would let him drink my blood slash imprint on me any day. An allergic emergency. I'm not laughing because it's funny. There's nothing funny about, you know, having to use an EpiPen. I'm laughing because I know personally, if I had a peanut allergy and I touched a peanut and someone pulled out the fucking EpiPen, I would just tell them, yo, let nature take its course. Just fucking, just let me die. Ladies and gentlemen, the volume inside of this bus is astronomical. It is way... I got a little something to show y'all. So, uh, you, you know you had a good night if, uh, oh, you can't really see it. Uh, if <laughs> your bed moves off the racks a little bit, yeah. <laughs> I have night terrors. Carson! What's up? Can you help me with my eye drops? Yeah. yeah. Uh, thanks, so. Thanks, sir. No problem. Ladies, I don't know who needs to hear this, but... Hippity hoppity, your vagina's not his property. <laughs> they gave my cat a perm! <laughs> Who's the meanest? Most likely to get into a fight. Most emotional. Most likely to do weird things in public. Most likely to get pregnant after a one night stand. Who catches feelings quickest? Most likely to break someone's heart. Who's the funniest? Who's the alcoholic? Most likely to get cheated on? Most likely to catch an STD? Most likely to become a porn star? I'm making this TikTok because I think car sex gets a bad rap. Everyone fucking complains about having sex in cars all the time. Everyone's always like, oh, it's so awkward. There's not enough room. Where do I put my feet? Why are we in a Denny's parking lot? Shut up. Car sex is great. First of all, you have a built-in sound system, which is awesome. Okay. Second of all, if you get hungry while you're porking somebody, you get all those extra fries from McDonald's that are under your floorboards. Boom. Take it, extra snack, more stamina for banging, okay? Third of all, this is the best part, when you're banging somebody and, and all the windows get foggy, right? They, it gets all hot and humid. While you're laying in the back seat, you can draw toe art on the window. You can draw pictures while you're having sex with somebody. Why is everyone complaining? Hi, Matt. Hi, Matt. Dan. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> PSA time. You should be going after the depressed guys. Because if they're on antidepressants, one of the side effects is that you don't nut for like an hour and a half. So, you know. Brand new Lamborghini. Baby, make sure you save your love.
upside, Kamla. Both your sides are equally good. Come on. Mommy, can I get an arranged marriage? Indini, I, I am so tired. I slept at 3 a.m., okay? I have so much of work to do, okay? This is the last thing. Don't talk some nonsense here, okay? So is that a no? Nandini, first finish your uh, degree, get a job, okay? Then worry about marriage. 